Hello, welcome to Roulette Profit and Stop here on YouTube. On this recording, I'm going to be using the missing section roulette tool, which looks like this. I've recently done an update on this to track the streets and the corner bet as well as what it normally does. Uh, so anybody using this tool at the minute will automatically get the update. Any updates we do on any tools will be instant. You'll just see them added to the tools. Um, so missing section is what I'm going to be using. You can gain access to this tool from my website. Scroll down a little bit, you'll be able to see the roulette tool comparison table. Shows you inside bets, outside bets, all bet types, single or double table, double zero tables. Missing sections ticked all the boxes, so click on the link to that. That gets me to the tool. And um, you can use it over 30 days, 60 days, or 90 days at different price points. And um Whichever tool, whichever option you use, um, you can uh, wait for my email reply. And if you get a, when you get the passcode from me, uh, you come back to this site, click on the green button, that boots the tool up. Agree to the terms, input your passcode, job done. That's it. It's as simple as that. Right, minimize that. And there we go. So I'm going, to, I'm going to play in a few different tables, try and get a few different win types. Click to play. You've got um, tracking values at the bottom of the tool itself. Six misses in a row, nine misses in a row, 20 misses in a row, and 50 minutes misses in a row. Six misses in a row applies to 1 to 18, even red, black, odd, 19 to 36. First, second, third dozens, bottom, middle, top columns. The nine misses in a row applies to 1, 4, 7, 10, 13, 16, 19, 22, 25, 28, 31, 34 streets. And 20 misses in a row applies to the corner bets. And 50 misses in a row applies to each individual number. So that's what those values do. And you can reduce these and adjust them or increase them to whatever values you want to use or track. Uh, but 6, 9... Uh, 20 and 50 are the uh, default settings at the minute. So I want to input the history of numbers from this table into the tool. So 13, 29, 22, 32, number 9, number 1, 22, 21, after 21 is 28. There you go. You can see the blue markers to show that those streets have missed for at least 9 spins. Uh, that was 28, then 35, 10, and then number 4, number 20, and number 16. Right, so we've got top column not hitting, 26, for 7 spins. That is my first bet. Please place your I'll do a 50 pence bet on that top column. So 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, or 36. No more bets, please. If this hits, I'll get one pound profit. Start with 76.40 today. Well, on this recording now, 76.40. So it's not hit the top column for seven spins in a row. Now, you're not guaranteed to get your hit, um, you know, because it's not hit. It will eventually, but um, place your bets. you might not have a, a, a bankroll to support carrying on trying to chase to get that hit. So limit your amount of bets, bets you put out there close. to try and get that hit otherwise you will lose your money because the casinos are here to take your money don't allow them to take your money no more bets, please. limit your action that'll that'll reduce what you give the casinos anyway this is my second bet for the top column here we go 22 is a miss 22 third bet coming up Please place your bets. Repeat, add a chip, £1.50. Third bet for the top column. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, bets 24, closed. 27, 30, 33, or 36. And I'm looking for one hit to get me into profit. Then I'll switch to a different, no more bets, different bet, a different area. And then I'll, switch, I'll do some switching of tables. I'll get a couple of wins on this table, switch to another one. Try and get a couple of wins on a different table. 31. 
Right, we've got an intersection bet. I'm not going to play it, but this is now my fourth bet. Repeat, I'm going to stick to the original bet, which is the top column, just this bet. I could bet on 3, 6, 9, 12 with like £1 on each number. 50 pence on the 15 and a £1 bet on the 2-5 split and the 8-11 split. That would be my preferred bet if I'm placing the bet on the intersection number. An intersection number is when you've got a blue box highlighted around four numbers when you've got a dozen and a column and um, that I've hit the tracking value. 31, nearly number nine. So this is now my fifth bet. On my fifth bet, I repeat and add two extra chips. So this is now my fifth bet. If I miss this one and I want to give it another bet, I'll repeat and add three chips, but that'll be my limit to playing the dozens and the columns. No more bets, please. So I really want this one to hit, ideally. So this this spin to hit the top column number sixteen is a miss. Sixteen. Right, we've got some corner bets here. It's all happening Please around that region. I'm gonna repeat the bet and add three more. So this is my final bet. This is my bets sixth bet. Closing. And this is why I limit my action. I will not carry on and chase that top column. Because it's not hit, no, I don't think. Please. I am not in the mindset of, because it's not hit, it's bound to hit. I'm not thinking like that, because I could easily blow the rest of this balance just trying to hit the top column number. That might might miss for 24 more spins. It has hit. That is my win. Red. But that took you win. far too long. Please play I'm going to do the first best. dozen. I'll give the first dozen a go. But you can see some green markers here. So a few green markers. They're corner bets, bets that I haven't hit for 20 spins. You've got the blue markers for the streets. I'm currently doing the no first dozen because it's not hit for 9 spins. And it's highlighted blue. And then I'll switch over to the um, street bets in the corners. So I've had one win so far. 30. 30. Red. Another intersection bet. So it's doing intersection bets, which is usually when it does the intersection bet, that means it's um, bets closing. That, what does that normally tell me? I can't remember what that normally no tells me. Bets, please. Because uh, the intersection bet normally comes in early on, not late on, like it's doing now. So this would be a negative for me. Anyway, first dozen, 1, 3 to 12. 32. 32. Red. Repeat the bet. Still on the first Please dozen. Place your bets. Add a chip. First, first still on the first dozen. Bets uh, let's see if I can catch another win. So I'm, gonna, I'm only going to get a couple of wins on this one, then I'll switch tables. No more bets, please. I'll try and get a win on the streets and on the corner. So I've done at least a I've done at least a column, a dozen. That was 32. naughty. That was Red. naughty. That that was Please a naughty but all maneuver. Naughty, naughty. As that was in my number three, so that was really annoying. That's what it does, though. This table. It'll hit your number that you want, and then it'll bubble out of it and go somewhere else. This is what exactly what these tables do to drive your mental. No more bets, <laughs> please. Here we go. So seventy-six forty start on this recording. Looking for one to twelve. Twenty-six. Not enough. Black. Right, this is now my fifth Please bet. Please place your bets. So repeat and add two chips. And if this misses, repeat and add three chips. It took me six bets, bets to get the top column to hit. This is my fifth bet on the first dozen. So this could be an elongated bets, setup as well. And if it is, if it's difficult like this, you want to be changing tables, which is what I'm going to be doing. So if I get this one hitting now, I'm going to change tables. I'm not going to even attempt to do any more bets on this one. There you go. There's my hit on seven. Red. Not comfortable with this table, Please so I'm going to click the bets. MS button to get me back to the main menu screen. Go to the lobby. I'm in profit, by the way. I made two quid, so I'll take that and move on uh, to a different table. 
We'll do speed roulette. And give this a bit of a blast. And click to play. So everything's reset. 24. Hit input the history. 8, 29. Because it was going way too high. But I was getting my hits. But it was going way too long before hitting. That's a massive negative. Because it's likely to keep doing that and go even further. And um, that's where you lose your money basically. Because your, your expectation will outgrow your bankroll normally. <laughs> anyway, here we go. So, I'm going to do the street bets on this one. So the blue markers are showing what's not hit for at least 9 spins or greater. So I'm going to bet on those to hit. I've got 78.40. Made £2 profit on the other table. There's 16. That's a corner. So we've got 7, 10, 13. 22. Oh, there you go. So they're all the blue markers for street bets that have yet to hit. For at least nine spins or greater. So I'm on 7, 10, 13, 22, and 28. So these are the, the streets that have yet to hit. These ones here. 12, there you go, there's a hit. Boom. It's a win. I'll repeat the bet and get rid of that street. So now it's a 40 pence bet. Four streets have yet to hit. I'm probably better betting on the uh, opposing streets. The streets that have hit, as opposed to the ones that haven't, when I've only got four streets that haven't hit. So this is too few of too few streets to bet on to get my win. I could get lucky and hit on one of these, but not many streets I'm covering here to get that hit. Yeah, see, so thirty-one's added. We're going to add that, and we're going to double up. No more bets, please. Try and get to eighty pound on this one. Get to eighty pound in the balance. So seven, thirteen, twenty-two, twenty-eight, thirty-one. Number three is a miss. Three red. So repeat the bet. Place your bet. I'll start another chip. Bet closing. I'm adding ten pence every time I lose. No more bets, please. On the streets. So let's see what that three takes me. Is it going to go to 7, 8, 9, 13, 14, 15, 22, 23, 24, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, or 33? Or is it not going to hit any of those and be another miss? Find out in a minute. 19. The miss. 19 red. Repeat the bet. Add a chip. Bet's closing. No more bets. I didn't get the chance to put 28 and 31 on. Which is really tilting. <laughs> really, you, you don't know how tilting that is. That's really tilting. Well, this is speed wheel that I've got. Little to no time to place a bet. So I want 7, 13 or 22 to land. 7, 13, 22 streets. 13, boom. That's that's okay because that gives me a bit more money back. Now I've got a corner. I'm going to do the corner bet. I'm just going to do the corner bet. There you go. So I'm nearly at my target of £80. Playing two different tables, making £3.60 profit. 17, there you go. There's my corner. Boom. Now I'm going to go on the streets that I haven't yet hit, but this is going to be difficult for me to put them all on in time. Oh, shit. Especially if I make mistakes. Oh, I need 25 and 34. These are the streets that have already hit. So not the blue ones, but the ones that haven't got blue markers on them 25 and 34 would have been a bet um, oh, 23. 23 that's red. a street that's eight, eight. please place your bets repeat uh, 23 and 34 double right here we go bets closing. so i'm doing the streets no that haven't uh that have hit already streets that have already hit is what i'm betting on so, not the blue markers, but the ones that haven't got blue markers on them. Ta-da! Right, third dozen. 50 pence on that. That's highlighted blue. Let's play that. I've got £80 in the balance. Two tables played. 
please. 14 minutes in. Already in profit. Small stakes. Small wins, that's what it's all about for me. 25 to 36. 34 is a hit. Boom. Red. The win. You First win. dozen. Please place Let's your jump bets. on that. So that's highlighted six spins without a hit. Bets closing. So this is no more bets, please. This is um the missing section tool. It's a fantastic tool this. This has got quite a lot of information in it. If you can't make use of this and win, I'm so I'd be very surprised. If you're not able to get into profit of any amount at any point, I'd be very, very surprised. Like shocked almost. Please place your bets. I'm actually gonna add in a corner and Bet's closing. I wanted no to do the street on the ten as well. Corner and the street, although I'm gonna swap that street four street to the ten. Unless this hits. Oh, 19 here. 19 red. Please place your bets. There we go. Bets closing. No so I'm on please. first dozen, third bet. I'm on the two streets, 7, 10. And I'm on the um, corner bet, 7, 11. So if I hit 7, 7, 8, 10 or 11, that's jackpot. Oh, there you go. Eight jackpot. Boom. Thank you. That's hitting everything, that. You win. Please place your bet. That's now 84.50. I'm going to stop there. Go back to the main menu. Go back to the lobby. So I've taken a little bit more money off that table. So I think I've done pretty well on that one. Now I'm going to switch to um, the 20 peach steak table. I'm going to try and get just a couple of wins on this one, not too many, because it takes quite a long time to spin up this one. So input the numbers. 2, 25, 14, 14, 8, 8. Look at these repeats as well. 9, 31. That's an intersection. Boom. Number 2, number 5, 33, 33. Wow, a lot of repeating numbers. Second dozen's not hit for 9. Uh, let's see. Number eight. Eight. Black. We go with second dozen here. Please place your bets. Um. We'll just do twenty pence on the second dozen. I'm only looking bets. to get a couple of wins on this. A couple of wins on this one. Maybe I'll do a second. I'll do a dozen bet. Maybe a no more bets, column please. bet. And a street bet. So looking for 13 to 24. This one takes quite a while to spin. So I want a couple of wins on this. 13 to 24. Nearly number 21. Two black. Two black. Intersection. We'll do this intersection Please bet. Place your bets. This is my intersection bet. I'll show you how I do it. 40 pence on each number. It's costing me 280 there. I've done 40 pence on 13, 16, 19, 22. I've done 20 pence on 10, 20 pence on 25, and I've done the splits 14, no 17, bets, and the split 20, 23. So looking for 13, 16, 19, 22, as are the jackpot numbers to hit. 13, 16, 19, 22, the numbers in the blue box to hit. They're the jackpot. Eighteen, sixteen, nineteen, twenty-two. Eight is a miss. Eight, black. I'm going to repeat the same bet. Please place your bet. Same bet, repeat. Same stake. Bets closing. No more bets. So please. this might be number ten at a push. Ten if I'm lucky. If it's number 10, I'll be pretty happy with that. If it's 13, 16, 19, 22, I'll be over the moon. Even if it's 25, that'll be pretty good as well. So 10, 25, 13, 16, 19, or 22 could be perfect. 10, 25, 13, 16, 19, 22. 17 is good. That's a split. That'll do. That's giving me some money. 
for. You win. Now 20 to 29 is not hit. Bets. So we'll do these bits. That's the splits on the 20s. Because 20 to 29 is not hit for 15 bets spins. Close. So that's what I'm betting on now. Section number is not hitting. So any number in the 20s to land. No more bets and if that hits, that's a second win. It might hit number... Oh, I'm not going to hit the 26. I've not covered 26. Oh, what the fuck? 26. If it's hitting 27, that's a straight up. I should have covered the 26, 27 split. I made a mistake. Don't be 26, because that'll piss me off. You absolute cunt. 26. That's an absolute cunt trick, because I'm sure I did the split on 27. And that's just landed that. That's what really drives me fucking insane. That's fucking shocking, man. Bets closing. It's always going to be the number that you've not got. This is what these no casinos bets, do. And that's how you know you're going to lose. That's <laughs> if if there's something that you've made a mistake on, that's the number that's going to come in always, hundred percent, hundred percent. There's nothing worse than that happening. That's annoying so if this hits i'm stopping i'm not going to continue because i'm that's just piss me off anyway top column oh, sorry bottom column number 147 10 13 69 22 25 28 31 or 34 9 9 red repeat the bet add a chip so i'm going to play this till i win now repeat add a chip if this hits, I get six pound return. That gets me to eighty-seven ninety, and eighty-seven ninety is just over a ten pound profit bets, on this short please. recording. Small stakes, and no more bets, please. Using the missing section tool. So if I hadn't have done a mistake on the twenty-six twenty-seven split, I would have hit on that twenty-six, and that would have been a stop for me. I only wanted to do a couple of wins on this because this this table takes ages to spin. That's fucking annoying. This better fucking hit. 147, 10, 13, 16, 19, 22. 17 for me. 17. Right, got a couple of corners, but Please I'm just playing the dozen. Bets. Third bet. This is my third bet for the dozen. I'm going to play this dozen out until I get my hit. So, bets closing. hopefully it's going to hit 25, 13, 19. No more bets, please. Uh, four or thirty-four. Any of those? Fantastic. Any number in that bottom column. Not hitting for eleven spins. Not guaranteed to get my hit because it's not hit for that many times. I don't expect it to hit because it's not hit for that many times. I just do the bet. If it's not playing within my betting range, I sack it off and do something different. Thirty-one. There you go. There's my hit. Thank you. Flat. Boom. You win. That is Please missing section tool. I hope you enjoyed that. Eighty-seven ninety is what I've got. Um, let's have a quick look at what I've got. Eighty-seven ninety. Um, seventy-six four. I made eleven pounds fifty pence. Eleven pound fifty. That is pretty good. Happy with that? Absolutely. So today. I have made total 11.5, 9, 12, and 12.60. 45 pounds, 10 pence at this casino today. Started with 20 pounds at yesterday, and I made 45 quid today. I already made profit yesterday on it, so I'm showing you daily, or I'm showing you, you know, consistent gains is what I'm doing using my tools anyway thanks for tuning in i hope you enjoyed the content don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe and all that kind of stuff that'd be great and if you want to use the tools head over to my website which you'll find in the description below and just below the main header on my youtube channel thanks again see you soon